So we're going to show you how to make um, these little decoupaged pots here. These are little terracotta pots, um, the same material as this here. You need to start off by painting it white, like this. Um, you need to put on several layers of uh, white acrylic paint because otherwise it will be um, uh, partially transparent and it needs to be completely opaque. Um, so you can water down the acrylic paint just a tiny little bit, which will make it easier to go on. And because the terracotta is porous, it sucks it up quite quickly. So you need about four coats of this. It takes about two hours to dry for each coat. Um, but I would leave it overnight before you start the actual decoupaging process, which is sticking these little bits of napkin onto your pot. So once your pot is completely white uh, and opaque, you can start cutting out your little bits of napkins, whichever design you choose. Cut them out very carefully like that. And then we can start sticking them on the little pot. So you need a tiny amount of PVA glue. You can see here, it's hardly any in there. And a little bit of water, 50-50. Um, the reason we put the water in is because it makes the napkins much easier to stick on and uh, move about if we need to. So mix that up quite thoroughly and you'll see it looks like milk. Um, so take your napkins, cut out pieces. These napkins are three ply. It means it's got three different bits of paper on it. You need to take off those bits of paper because it will make your butterfly easier to put on and it will make it look like it's been painted on rather than a piece of paper that's been stuck on. Take your pot as a little bit of the glue water solution on where you're going to stick your butterfly and carefully put your butterfly onto the pot. I prefer to stick mine on at an angle, but the preference is up to you. Stick the butterfly on very, very carefully and then add on very carefully and gently with your brush some more of the PVA fluid. Just be very gentle so you don't tear the delicate areas and then go around adding all of your other butterflies. Once you've gone around the whole pot, you'll end up with something like this. I've chosen some bees and some primroses and some butterflies. It would take about two hours to dry. And when it's dry, you then can add your gloss of more PVA glue. You can make it a little bit thicker than the water solution that I've got. If it goes on white, it really doesn't matter because it will dry clear. Once you've covered your pot completely with the PVA glue, let it stand to dry somewhere where it won't stick. So um, on a little plastic pot or some tin foil. And there you have it.